Hi there, Jeff Watts here, and July has been an absolutely great month for me in my Agile Mastery community. I thought I'd give you a quick roundup as to what's been going on. For me, it's been brilliant to see how the community's continued to grow since we started it and opened it up to a free wider membership. And we've now got over 500 members. And according to my analytics tool, 57% of those people are coming back time and time again, and 32.9% of them are actually contributing on a regular basis, which I think is amazing, really. Now, that contribution could be through posting a question. It could be about adding your own experiences into the comments to help somebody else out. It could be people cheering other people's participation. It could be attending an event or having some more private, less visible one-to-one -one chats with other members of the network. But whatever that participation is, I think it's brilliant. And I actually think it's gonna to continue to rise because more and more people are feeling more and more comfortable in this setting. They're getting used to it. So we'll see more and more people coming out of their shells. Now every month we have a theme of the month and this month we've had a theme of making change happen and we've had discussions around psychological safety, the differences between Miro and Mural and the new Miro and Zoom integration. We've been talking about moving on from teams, leaving teams from a coaching perspective after working with them for many years. We've had people sharing job openings for scrum masters and product owners. We've had people asking and talking about the challenge of dealing with teams who are open to Agile in name but apparently a bit more resistant to Agile in practice. Lots of other interesting discussions. And in my smaller subscription channel, which is called Jeff's Agile Pirates, we've had some private bespoke sessions. First of all, with the remote coach, Chris Stone, where together we designed a remote retrospective based on the theme of pizza. And you can get that template from Chris's website and his LinkedIn profile. We also had a bonus session with Nims Dewan, who helped us look at how we can get better at aligning our expectations between one another and teams and managers and so on through the coaching practice of contracting. And we also had our monthly social, our Lean Coffee event, mostly focused around making change happen, plus a professional coaching circles where we could practice our coaching skills, our observation skills, our feedback skills. So another great month, really. Now, I started this community with the aim of giving people a space that was supposed to be safer and less ego-driven than what you might find in typical social media or online forums, but also one that was more diverse than your own company's Slack channel and one that was a little bit more private and tailored than your average meetup group that you might go to on a Wednesday after work or something. And I've been really pleased to see how that's actually come to fruition. And the conversation has remained exactly as was intended in the Code of Conduct. It's been respectfully diverse, open sharing of ideas, open-minded receiving of ideas, exploring different options, exactly what I was hoping for. For those of you who follow my work, who watch some of my videos on YouTube, read my blog posts, my articles, things like that, this community is somewhere that you can interact directly with me, as well as other Agilists, of course, and you can keep up to date with all of my latest developments and offerings, things, for example, like my new on-demand courses, leadership courses, which are actually getting some really positive feedback, and my articles and tweets and inspirational messages and so on. And our theme in August is sustainable pace. So we'll be looking at all aspects of that from an individual level, a team level, product level, organizational level, plus the more general questions and scenarios that crop up outside of that theme. And I'm really excited to say we've got an awesome triple special guest workshop this month with who I'm calling the Queens of Remote Facilitation, Kirsten Clacy, JL and Morris. And they're teaming up with Joe Perold, a good friend of ours, and they're gonna help us explore a personal remote collaboration manifesto, which I'm looking forward to. We're still welcoming new members, and remember this community is completely free. There are even spaces in the subscription channel, that Pirates channel, if you want to go deeper and get even more exclusive content, come along to some of these workshops, for example. Um, and it would be great if I see you there at some point, but if not, have a great summer.